What's up guys, Asa here. I've been chilling at home, but I thought I'd give you guys a little glimpse into my lockdown lifestyle. So this is my living room. This is where I spend most of my time, whether I'm playing games on the couch, watching TV, watching films. Here are my shelves, this is where I put all my collectibles. I got my Gundam figurines. I got my games collection down here, my consoles, my various Nintendo, in fact, they're almost all Nintendo consoles. I've got all sorts of other bits. I've got some pictures on here. This one was from the sex education rap party. And that's me and my mom and my bro, looking very dapper indeed. Up top, I've got some night vision goggles. Don't ask me why, but I just have them. My Akira box set, which I'm a big fan of manga and anime. So I do love video games, but something I love possibly just as much, possibly even more, oh, in fact, my board games. Further up here, we have my Dungeons and Dragons collection. And you might be thinking, Asa, wow, you are such a nerd. Well, the truth is, yes, yes, I am a nerd, but nothing is better than hanging out with your mates, throwing off some fireballs and killing loads of goblins. So kiss my spell book and um, yeah. Uh, I got my music corner. This is where me and my brother spend actually quite a lot of our time. We're both quite musical. He's a drummer, so he's got his sort of homemade drum kit. We got some keys. Oh, it's not plugged in. I started playing piano when I was a kid, uh, so I had to keep it up. And I got a little keys here now, so I can keep jamming. I got my bass, which I've been learning recently, uh, which is the coolest instrument in the world, objectively. Um, and if you disagree, then you're wrong. Guitar, microphone, for those of us who can sing, I cannot, but I still try. So I got my music, I got my games, but you know, I've also got some work to do, whether it's reading scripts or talking to directors, writing things. As an actor, you kind of ever really know when you're going to be working next. I started acting when I was about nine years old. But when I was a kid, I didn't want to be an actor. Um, I wanted to like dig up dinosaurs and stuff. And it wasn't actually till I started getting onto set and working with other actors and kind of learning about the history of film and not just acting, but all the other processes that go into it. They all so kind of fascinating. It just really excited me, especially as a kid. It just captured my imagination. And I was really lucky to get to be a part of some incredible films when I was that age. And I think that really inspired me to continue doing it and continue working as an actor. This is where all of the real magic happens. This is where I put all the things that I'm probably too embarrassed to put in my living room because nobody really gets to see this room except me and my closest friends. This is all my posters, all my kind of nerdy memorabilia. I've got my Game Boy drink coasters, which I thought were too nice to use drinks for, so now they're up on my wall. I got a certificate from when I went to the Nintendo World Championships back in 2000, hello Lyra, back in 2017, uh, signed by the man Reggie himself. That was one of the funnest weekends of my life. I'm a huge Dota fan, so I've got a big old Dota poster on my wall. And various Aegis's from Dota tournaments up there. Uh, I've got a poster from my first, the first Smash Ultimate Summit last year. And I got to meet a load of the top players, which was pretty cool. I've got an Otis Milburn pop action figure, which was never actually released. And someone made this for me. They got it custom made, custom painted, which is just amazing and uh, very touching. So thank you. So today we're playing Ori and the Will of the Wisps and I got it up now on my new ROG G14 laptop. If you're a fan of like Metrovanias, like Hollow Knight or Super Metroid, I'd definitely recommend checking this game out. I went for the, uh, the Quad HD resolution version of the G14 and with a 14 inch screen, that many pixels is like, it's insanely sharp. I've only just started playing but I can already get a sense of this world. It kind of reminds me almost of like Studio Ghibli movies in its art style and its kind of fairy tale like quality. Yeah, and I can block the laser. All right, here we go. Oh, <gasps> oh 
I died again. So that was it guys. I showed you my home. I showed you my games. I showed you the things I've been up to. You met my cats. Maybe you learned something about me. Maybe you didn't. Maybe you just realized you've always wanted to play Dungeons and Dragons. Either way, I hope I made your day a little bit better. But it's now time for me to go and have some dinner. So I will see you all on the other side. Peace.